Top 10 Things to Do in Lisbon 2024 Lisbon, the stunning coastal capital of Portugal, is a city steeped in history, culture, and breathtaking landscapes. Welcome to Paradise Planet, and today, we are thrilled to present to you the ultimate guide to experiencing the very best of Lisbon. Whether you're a seasoned traveler or a first-time visitor, our carefully curated list of the top 10 things to do in Lisbon in 2024 will open your eyes to the wonders of this vibrant city. From savoring delectable Portuguese cuisine to exploring ancient castles and vibrant neighborhoods, this guide is your key to unlocking the heart and soul of Lisbon. So sit back, relax, and let's dive in! Before we move on, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and enable notifications. Make sure to share your own Lisbon experiences in the comments below and stick around till the end of this video because we have an important bonus attraction for you that you shouldn't miss. Number 10. Sunset Cruise on Tagus River Experience the breathtaking beauty of Lisbon from a whole new perspective with the Sunset Cruise on the Tagus River. As the sun dips below the horizon, the city comes alive with a golden glow, creating a truly magical atmosphere. The gentle breeze and the soothing sound of the water make this experience unforgettable. Prices for a sunset cruise start at around $30 per person and most tours last approximately 2 hours. Many visitors have left positive reviews praising the stunning views and the relaxing ambience. Sunset cruises usually operate in the late afternoon so it's the perfect way to unwind after a day of exploring the city. Number 9. Balam Tower the Bellum Tower is a must-visit attraction in Lisbon, recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Built in the 16th century, this iconic tower served as a strategic defense fortress at the mouth of the Tagus River. Entrance fees are around $6 per person and the tower is open to visitors from 10 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. It's not just a historic site, but also a symbol of Europe's age of discovery, offering a fascinating glimpse into Portugal's rich maritime history. Nearby, you can also explore the monument to the discoveries and enjoy a leisurely stroll along the beautiful waterfront promenade Bellum. The Bellum Tower is highly recommended by travelers for its stunning architecture and panoramic views of the river. Number 8. Mercado da Ribeira and Other Food Destinations A visit to Lisbon isn't complete without immersing yourself in its rich culinary culture. The Mercado da Ribeira, a market with roots dating back to the 13th century, is a must-visit. Over the centuries, it has evolved and modernized, with the market hall of boasting iron interiors and a grand oriental dome inaugurated in 1882. The market is a gastronomic paradise split into a traditional section selling fresh produce and a modern food hall hosting over 30 stalls and bars. Expect to pay around $16.5 to $22 for a meal. While here, also explore other foodie destinations like the Bohemian Alex Factory, a former textile factory now hosting trendy eateries, unique shops, independent art studios, and Livraria Ler de Vagar, a bookstore like no other. The bookstore is open from 10 a.m. to midnight and it has received positive reviews for its lively vibe and diverse food offerings. Number 7. Old Style Forms of Public Transportation if you're visiting Lisbon, don't miss the chance to hop on the charming trams that have been a part of the city since 1901. The famous tram number 28 will take you through the old city and other iconic spots. It's a popular choice for tourists and a great way to explore the steep hills and beautiful sights. The cost per person is affordable, making it a budget-friendly option for getting around. Additionally, you can also experience the funiculars like Ascensor do Labra, which was the city's first funicular dating back to 1884. The opening hours are usually from early morning until late at night so you can enjoy the rides at your convenience. Visitors have left positive reviews about the nostalgic streetcars and funiculars, praising them as a unique and enjoyable way to see the city. Number 6. Castela de S. George or St. George Castle This iconic fortress dating back to the 1st century AD has witnessed the rise and fall of different civilizations. 
Once fortified residences for king, it now offers visitors a chance to explore the ruins of the royal palace, a fascinating exhibition of archaeological finds and breathtaking panoramic views of the city. And let's not forget about the lively peacocks strutting around like they own the palace. The entrance is reasonable at $10 per person and the castle is open from 9am to 9pm so you have plenty of time to soak in the atmosphere. With rave reviews from visitors, this is a must-see attraction in Lisbon. Number 5. Oceanario de Lisboa If you're looking for a fantastic time in Lisbon, you've got to check out the Oceanario de Lisboa, the biggest indoor aquarium in Europe. It's home to over 16,000 marine critters and plants including cool sharks, adorable otters, and hilarious penguins. You can wander through four different habitats and learn all about sea life with handy info panels. The main exhibit is a massive tank with glass panels in all the right places, giving you an awesome underwater view. And while you're in the area, have a look at the Expo 98 site where you will find the stunning Vasco da Gama Bridge and the impressive Torre Vasco da Gama. Plus, you can hop on a cable card for a bird's eye view of the whole site. It's a must-see for any ocean lover. Number 4 Museum of Art, Architecture and Technology Explore the Museum of Art, Architecture and Technology also known as MAD. This cool spot opened its doors in 2016 and offers a unique mix of art, architecture, and technology exhibitions. The building itself is pretty eye-catching. Located right by the River Tagus with a killer rooftop view of the 25 de Abril Bridge and the city. Instead of boring old permanent collections, math gives things fresh with temporary exhibits from both local and, and international artists and architects. Also, they've got a former power plant turned permanent exhibition venue called Tejo Power Station. If you're into museums and want something a little different, math is a definitely worth a visit. They're super affordable and open all day. Number 3. Commerce Square This place has it all. History, stunning views, and a bustling atmosphere. Overlooking the Tagus River, it's a hub of activity with important state offices and a historic waterfront area. Don't miss the iconic Arco da Rawa Augusta where you can climb to the top for some jaw-dropping city views. After that, take a leisurely stroll down Rua Augusta, lined with shops and restaurants. And if you're in need of a break, head over to Russia Square, one of Lisbon's oldest and most charming spots. Sit back at a cafe like Cafe Nicola, soak the traditional Portuguese pavement, and admire the Baroque fountains. It's totally free to explore all this, so visit and experience the charm of Commerce Square. Number 2. Hieronymus Monastery If you're in Lisbon, don't miss out on a visit to Hieronymus Monastery. A stunning example of 16th century Manuelan architecture, this place took a whopping 100 years to build, replacing an old church used by helpful monks. The intricate design incorporates maritime elements carved in limestone from Vasco da Gama's expedition, showing off Portugal's wealth during the Age of Discoveries. You can stroll through the two-story cloisters in the Church of Santa Maria, soaking in the history and grandeur. Plus, it's a UNESCO World Heritage Site and the final resting place of King Manuel I and the legendary explorer Vasco da Gama. You won't need to break the bank to explore this monastery. The entrance fee is around $10 per person. They are open from 10 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. so you have plenty of time to explore and snap some envy in dissing photos. Number 1. Lisbon Zoo no matter your age, a trip to the zoo will always be fun and memorable, and especially so at the Lisbon Zoo. The zoo, founded in 1884, is the first park with various flora and fauna in the Iberian Peninsula. Today, Lisbon Zoo is home to over 2,000 animals from 300 different species from all over the globe, including dolphins, tigers, reptiles, primates, and other animals. The mission of the zoo is also a scientific research, conservation, and breeding of endangered species along with recreational activities. Embark on a unique adventure and explore the zoo from a different perspective and jump on a fascinating 20-minute cable car ride. And here is the bonus that we promise! Bonus, if you have extra time, you should check out the Almada District and visit the Cristo Rey National Sanctuary. 
It's a popular spot for people who want to enjoy peaceful moments while taking in the stunning views of the river and the city. You might find it familiar because it looks like the Christ the Redeemer statue in Rio de Janeiro. Thank you for watching guys! Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to never miss out on exclusive travel-related content like this.